Good morning, children. Today we are going to learn about plane figures. In the last class, we have learned about point, line, and line segment. Let us learn today about plane figures. Now, what do you mean by plane figures? Figures you will learn plane and solid. Plane figures which are flat, which have one flat face, which have no thickness. Like this paper you can see, it has one flat face, it has no thickness. This is a plane figure. This blackboard, the face is flat, no thickness. It is a plane figure. But when I show you this duster, you will see that the duster is a solid figure. It has thickness. You can see different faces of the duster. This is one face. When you turn back, you see another face. So there are different faces in the duster. But in this blackboard, you will see only one flat face. It is plain figure which has no thickness. So today let us learn about this plain figure. Can you tell me the name of this plane figure? It is a rectangle. Yes, what is it? A rectangle. You know the spelling children? R-E-C-T. Rect. A-N-G-L-E. Angle. Rectangle. Now in this rectangle, how many sides you can see? This is one side. Sides are the Line segments. You have learnt a line segment. A starting point and an ending point with two end points. Another side two, then another side three and another side four. So it has four sides or you can say four edges. How many vertices? Now what do you mean by a vertex? These corners are the vertices. Corners. So, how many corners in a rectangle? Four corners. Four vertices. So children, once again you listen. A rectangle has four sides. Sides are the line segments. With one common corner. Now this is one side. This is another side 2, another side 3 and another side 4. And 4 corners. Like can you give me some examples? Like this blackboard has 4 sides and 4 corners. You can see in your room the door. Can you see the door has 4 sides and 4 corners? The wall in your room that also has 4 sides, 4 corners. So these are the examples of rectangles. Now let us see the other plane figure. This is the other plane figure we are going to learn about. Can you tell me what is this plane figure? Yes, it is a square. S-Q-U-A-R-E square. Now square has how many edges? It has four edges, just like the rectangle, four edges and it has how many vertices, how many corners, four corners. So like a rectangle, a square also has four sides and four corners. Then what is the difference between a square and a rectangle? Square and this is a rectangle. Can you tell me what is the difference? In a square you can see all the sides are equal. All sides are of equal length. If I say this side is 2 cm, this side will be also 2 cm, the other side 2 cm and 2 cm. So all sides will be 2 cm. But in a rectangle, all sides are not equal. If the top is 
5 cm the bottom will be 5 cm if the left is 2 cm right will be 2 cm so in a rectangle opposite sides are equal all sides are not equal so this is the difference between a square and a rectangle square all sides equal rectangle opposite sides equal did you understand children now can you give me some examples of a square square shaped objects so you all play chess a chess board have you seen it is of square shape carom board that is also of square shape okay handkerchief which you use hankies are of square shape so now children try to find out some more objects which are rectangular or square in shape thank you children see you in the next class